Hi, I'm Simon, a Let's Get Cooking Regional Manager, and I'm here today with Laura, a nutritionist for the Children's Food Trust. Now, Laura is going to give us the top tips for parents with children who are revising for their exams this summer. So what's your first tip? Okay, my first tip would be to eat breakfast. So it's really important that we all eat breakfast every day, but particularly for young children on the morning before an exam. We hear about this all the time, but we should eat breakfast. Why is it so important? It's really important because um, it gives us the energy that we need to start the day after a long period overnight without food. Um, it also includes, um, can often include nutrients such as um, iron and vitamin C as well. And iron is really important for transporting oxygen around the bodies. Okay, any other tips? Yeah, I'd say to drink plenty of water. So we can often feel tired if we don't drink enough water um, and that's something that we're all guilty of. Um, so it's really important to make sure that we're fully hydrated so that we're able to concentrate for long periods of time. Great, what's your next tip? Okay, so my next tip would be to remember important words which are um, to eat little and often. Um, so we really want to be making sure that um, young people are having uh, three meals and two snacks every day just to kind of maintain blood sugar levels and energy levels as well to avoid those kind of slumps um, throughout the day. We've got some healthy snacks on the table. Yep. Are we roughly on the right track here? Yeah, definitely. So um, vegetable six, so things like carrots and then dried fruit and nuts are definitely really good snacks to be having throughout the day. What about if your child's in that horrible situation where you feel really tired physically and emotionally during exam period? I'd say to make sure that they get they were getting enough iron in their diets. Um, as I said earlier, iron's got a role in transporting oxygen around the body. So if we're not getting enough iron in our diets, we can often feel quite tired and lethargic. Um, so types of foods that you want to be including in their diets to give them um, a good source of iron would be things like red meat and poultry, um, dark green leafy vegetables, dried fruit and pulses, those kind of things. We have loads of recipes on the Let's Get Cooking at Home website with those types of foods in. So something from an omelette to a lamb curry or even a spaghetti bolognese.